All right, Ryan, uh, you guys are heading into your bye week. How important is it to maybe not look at the finish line and worry about the road ahead? Do you guys have to say anything to each other? Do you think the focus is there right now? Um, we're definitely focused. and um, I mean, tonight we want to finish off, uh, obviously, with the bye week coming up. We're not going to be playing for a little while, so we want to finish on a high note. and. Um, we all know that, and uh, we know that we need to come out after this and uh, put a huge, uh, strong performance in the late, latter half of the year. The guys liked what they did in Nashville. You guys pick up a win yesterday in Arizona. What are you guys starting to do well that's leading to the better play and then yesterday the success? Um, well, we're pretty resilient still right now. Um, I mean, in Nashville, we uh, were there the whole game. I thought uh, <clears throat> probably the last two periods we, we outplayed them, and um, unfortunately, that uh, the goal late in the game was uh, just offside, so uh, tough bounce there. But um, last night, obviously not the start that we wanted. I mean, uh, we know that they can come out hard, but um, we didn't match that well enough right off the bat. But we did uh, show a good job of uh, sticking with it and uh, having to push back even in the late, later half of the first period. The Golden Knights are kind of the darling of the league right now with how well they're playing and being a first you know, first team or first year team. Um, how different is the Golden Knights team you're going to face than the one you guys saw back at Rogers Place? Yeah, I think, uh, um, yeah, we can't definitely uh, can't expect a night like that again. Um, I think they had a bit of an off night. We had a, a good night and uh, a lot of stuff went in for us. So, um, I mean, we can take some confidence, take some uh, uh, momentum kind of out of that game and um, know that we can play with these guys and um, I mean, we showed it once, so, uh, but we can't expect an easy night by any means. And um, these guys work, and uh, we know that they have uh, four lines that just consistently go and uh, work hard every shift. So we got to find a find a way to outwork them and uh, be resilient again tonight. There was a lot of orange and blue in that building yesterday, and they were loud when you guys scored and chanting all night long. It sounds like half the city is here for this one. Uh, what's it like having Oilers fans travel like that? And does it actually, you know, get to you guys and help you out? Um, it's kind of nice when you're on a, a long road trip like this to, um, to have the fans come down and uh, support you even on the road. So, I mean, uh, we know how passionate they are at home, but it's, uh, it's pretty cool to see them come uh, down to places like this and uh, cheer us on.